Hey everyone, Technometry with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix the iPad that will not turn off. Now, generally, there's a few different ways to turn off a iPad. Traditionally, if you wanted to turn it off, you can for this one with the all screen, for example, I can press either of the volume up or volume down button along with the touch button, just like this. If I hold the volume up and the touch button, I can simply slide to power off. Maybe it's not working for you. You might also have tried going to your settings and then from there on going to general and then shut down and same exact thing of slide to power off. And other than the third method, you can also get Siri to turn it off by saying, hey Siri, power off. But if all of these methods haven't worked for you, you want to try this method. Now, if you have a sc all screen iPad, this is a mini sixth generation one. You can see here the volume up and volume down button are up the top here. So I'm going to press and release the volume up and then press and release the volume down button and then hold on to that touch ID or that lock button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appears. At that time, I'll let go of that side button. So to demonstrate this, volume up, volume down, and then I hold on to that lock or that touch ID button. And as you can see here, I'm holding it. I'm not doing anything to slide it off. Just keep on holding it till the screen goes completely black. And once it's gone completely black, I still keep on holding it till I see the Apple logo and I let go of it. And again, that will fix the iPad that doesn't turn off or won't shut off for you. As you can see here, all it does is shuts down the software and reloads the code. So if it's a software related issue impacting the iPad, it will fix it for you. Really safe to do and you might have to do it a few times to get the hang of it. So if it doesn't work the first time, just keep on trying that volume up, volume down one after another and then hold on to that touch ID or button. Now let's say you have maybe another iPad that's all screen where the buttons for the up uh, home for the volume up and volume down are on the side. Like this one, for example, if you have an, one of the newer Air, iPad Air, this is the Air one. You'll notice here the volume up and the volume down button are on the side. So all you do is press the volume up and then volume down and then hold on to that touch ID or the lock. And same exact thing happens. You don't want to do the slide to power off. Just wait till the screen goes completely black, which as you can see, I'm just holding on to this top button after I press the volume up and down button. And then I see the Apple logo up here and it will reboot up normally for me and again same exact process now if you have an ipad that might be with one of the older ones with the home button all you're going to do is instead of doing the volume up and down button you're going to take the top or the lock button and the home button now you're going to press and hold both of these two buttons at the same time so the lock up top or and the home button at the same time and as you can see here this one i just press and hold both of the buttons at the same time till the screen goes black you may see the Apple logo up here, and once it does, you let go of both of the lock and the home button at the same time, and that will also go ahead and fix the iPad that will not turn off. So that's how you fix the iPad that will not turn off. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPad and all the iOS devices. See you guys next time.